Hey everybody, Matt here. Um, this is going to be a little bit of a different video than I usually do. Um, I don't usually do uh, outdoor walking videos, but uh, you know, I'm uh, out for a jog tonight and uh, thought I'd do a video. Ha haven't done a video, uh, a political video in a while, and there's been a lot of stuff going on in the last week or so, politically speaking and e economically speaking that uh you know just really made me want to do a video and um a, a lot of you guys out there know i i pretty much kind of in the last few months have decided that um i was going to kind of cut it on watching the news and making political videos because it just all got burnt out on me you know just watching the news just became a never-ending sea of politics and bad news and just it's just depressing let's be honest <laughs> and um uh, you know, making political videos, you just get burnt out. For anybody who does them, you got to know after a while, they just really, going through a dark spot here on the road, but uh, they just really get old after a while, you know. You just, you feel like you're just talking in circles and saying the same things over and over and over and over again. So, kind of cut that out. But, uh, you know, all this stuff that's been going on with the... Uh, the uh, super congress or the super committee and our triple a rating and just just a lot of shit going on in a very short period of time i just felt like i needed to make at least some sort of video on it and i'm gonna try to keep this short although i already think i've been talking for fucking two minutes but you know my feelings on the super committee now coming from somebody who like i said i haven't been keeping up with all the news i you know watch a few, a few key elements here and there but you know, i'm gonna maybe get shit for that for not keeping up on current events like i should but um it, it, you know i understand there are people out there who think well this is for the debt this is uh, uh you know kind of a, d a debt commission as it were this is uh, to try and clear things up this is you know good intentioned and 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 i've seen some people out there who genuinely feel like this is this is a good thing at least potentially speaking but let's be honest when has government ever done anything with good intentions that actually turned out good okay even if their intentions really were good and genuine which most of the time they're not it always comes back to bite us in the ass these laws and rules and regulations and committees and they always end up overstepping their bounds they always end up going further than they were originally intended and somehow this super committee this super congress is going to bite us in the ass never mind the fact that let's be honest this really is not going to solve our debt problem this isn't going to solve our overspending problem this isn't going to solve any of our fucking problems okay this is just more government bureaucracy. Eh, that's just my opinion on it. And, you know, I want to hear what you guys think about it. But it's just bullshit. Okay. Then you've got our AAA credit rating. For so long, they've been saying nothing's ever going to happen to that. Yet, so many of us sat here and said, well, you can't keep doing the same shit over and over again and expecting nothing to happen. Well, here's finally something happens. Could any good come of this? I see more good coming of us losing our triple a credit rating than this whole super congress super committee at least us losing that gets people to step back and think you know it gets it gets average people it gets politicians it gets people who are you know in businesses tied directly to the economy it gets people to step back and go whoa wait a minute <laughs> we need to do something about this right here who knows will any good come of it i don't know is it just another step towards some sort of economic collapse? Maybe. I don't know. You know? I mean, we're to that point. We're just teetering on the edge, you know? I mean, what is it? I was watching a video today. The Israeli stock market has gone down 7% today and 5% yesterday. What are we down? 12% total over the weekend. It's Sunday night, by the way, when I'm recording this. Don't know when I'm going to upload it, but... <laughs> I mean, this 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 is going to happen. Now, will it right itself? Will will things happen? Will governments come together to fix problems? Will there, will there, will there be another quantitative easing? Will, will there be this, that, the other? We don't know. I don't know. 
Will things get better? Will things get worse? I, I don't know. <sighs> but it boils down to this. You know, what, what, what are you willing to do about it? What am I willing to do about it? You know, I, I can't do much but make videos and <laughs> hope it gets people thinking. And maybe somehow every, enough people get together and thinking about crap, we can, uh, I don't know what. <laughs> pressure our politicians who knows i mean we are we are we already at the point to where there's there's no going back i don't know maybe you know is it to the point to to where we we got to just hope that you know we've done the best we can with what we've got and hopefully you know america and I, as, as a people not as a government but as a people will we'll find a way to be okay i hope so and i think that's the case no matter what i'm, I'm pretty hopeful that america is not the horrible place that so many people pretend it to be you know I think we're a good people in general and I think we have the you know ability to overcome some pretty damn big problems you know that's just me but uh, I think I think there's trouble man I think there's some rough times ahead you know, I'm pretty confident in the fact that we can we can handle it, but you know, we all got we all got things to do, we all got <laughs> things to take care of. We all need to worry about you know, doing our best to take care of ourselves and our family and and politically speaking, man, I mean, you know, we got to be prepared to to make the right calls, you know? whether it's in elections or whatever. I mean, we, we, we need to start being a little more involved in our politics. And I think, I think most of us know that now, especially if you're watching my channel, you know. But maybe it's time we step out and we start talking to our family, we start talking to our friends. Of course, we should have already been doing this. Hopefully most of you were. I know probably most of you were. But it really, it's just... It's just, it's, it's time. We got to do something. We got to do something. I don't know what, you know, <laughs> but, um, anyway, I, I babbled on long enough. I didn't want to make this video too long, but anyway, I'd love to hear you guys thoughts on this. You know, it's, it's, it's a long road ahead and I think it's going to be a rough one, but you know, as much as I do the prepping thing and people think, oh, I'm a downer and this and that, you know, oh, we're all doomsayers. You know what? I, I got faith in us, man. Even, even through rough times, we're going to make it. There's no doubt about that. We've been through this shit before. As a, as a country, as a race of human beings, we've been through the shit before and we'll fucking make it through this time. It's going to be rough, though, and we need to be ready for it. We need to be ready to take action, whether it's politically or, or whether it's by preparing your family and friends, whatever it is. Anyway, I'm going to stop talking now again. I <laughs> appreciate you guys watching. Uh, Y'all let me know what you think about it. We'll talk to you later. Thanks.